decided to do this because this fulfills two uh, dreams of mine. One, to see how Bardic will work with Silent Herald Drink, because I think this is very cool and important. And two, to do this specific piece, which is one of my favorites and does not come up with really often. What's he that wishes so? My cousin Westmoreland? No, my fair cousin, if we are marked to die, we are a now to do our country loss. And if to live, the fewer men, the greater share of honor. God's will, I pray thee, <laughs> wish not one man more. <laughs> I am not covetous for gold, nor care I who doth feed upon my cost. It yearns me not if men my garments wear, such outward things dwell not in my desires. But if it be a sin to covet honor, I am the most offending soul alive. No, faith, my cuz, wish not a man from England. God's peace I would not lose so great an honor as one man more, methinks, would share from me for the best hope I have. Oh, do not wish one more, that he which, ha that he which hath no stomach for this fight, let him depart. His passport shall be made, and crowns for convoy put into his purse. We would not die in that man's company that fears his fellowship to die with us. This day is called the Feast of Crispy. He that outlives this day and comes safe home will stand a tiptoe when this day is named and rouse him at the name of Crispy. He that shall live this day and see old age will yearly on the vigil feast his neighbors and say, tomorrow is Saint Crispy. Then he will strip his sleeve and show his scars and say, these wounds I had on Crispy. Old men forget, yet all shall be forgot, but he'll remember with advantages what feats he did this day. Then shall our names familiar in his mouth as household words, Harry the King, Bedford, and Exeter, Warwick, and Talbot, Salisbury, and Gloucester. Be in their flowing cups freshly remembered. This story shall the good man teach his son. And Crispin Crispian shall ne'er go by from this day to the ending of the world, but we in it shall be remembered. We few, we happy few, we band of brothers. For he today that sheds his blood with me shall be my brother. Be he ne'er so vile this day shall gentle. And gentlemen in England now abed shall think themselves accursed they were not here, and hold their manhoods cheap while any speaks that fought with us upon St. Christmas. 